not all mine, I said. <laughs> Native Americans have so much wisdom, she said, and leaned closer to me. Do you know any sacred stories? Can you tell me a story? Okay, I said. This one took place in old times. There was a lone cavalry soldier. He was stationed at an abandoned fort in South Dakota. There were Lakotas not far off. The Lakotas watched this man and wondered at his strangeness. <laughs> <laughs> they saw him cleaning the fort. They thought he was crazy to be alone. Then they saw him trying to communicate with a wolf that had white front paws. Alicia interrupted me and said, that is a storyline for Dances with Wolves. <laughs> And Alicia stood behind me and started to run her fingers through my hair. It's unfair, she said. Indian men have such beautiful hair. It's so dark and thick and soft. You are a beautiful man. <laughs> Thanks, I said. But you know I have more of that beautiful hair around my cock. Alicia quickly pulled her hand away. You're disgusting, she screamed. Maybe so, I said. But your ideas of me are just as Alicia sat on my lap and kissed my cheek. She stood and left the apartment. There you go, Trevino, Lucy said. You have a great way with the ladies. <laughs> yeah, I know, I said. The crazy ones come to me like flies to dog shit. 